Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Michelle, and here on my channel I post a new budgeting video every single Monday. So if that sounds like something you might be interested in, please subscribe so you don't miss when I post a new video. Um, I'm also starting this new series because I am a server, um, and I'm starting this new series. I'm going to be posting every single Friday for how much I make every single week um, as a server. And I was going to add this cash stuffing because I'm doing these savings challenges. I'm doing a 300 envelope savings challenge every single week. And I was trying to add this at the end of my um, what I make in a week video. But the video was going to be like way too long. So I'm going to end up splitting it off. And um, I'm going to do my cash stuffing in a whole separate video. So I'm going to go ahead and get into the part that I already filmed before I decided that I'm going to split this up. And I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so like I said, um, I have, I don't know when I said it, if it was this video or June's budget with me, I have a 300 envelope challenge, which is insane. So here are my envelopes. Can you see them? Yeah. Okay, so this is my 200 envelope challenge. They are labeled two through 200. And this is my 50 week challenge. So I have um, 100 envelopes in here and they are labeled one through 50 twice. So I have two ones, two twos, all the way up to 50. Um, and these are the ones that I have already stuffed. So these ones are full. Um, and here's a little tracker I have because this, this challenge alone, it should give me over $20,000, like a little over $20,000 when I'm finished with it. And that's an insane amount of money to have just in cash laying around. And I just think it's going to be so much more beneficial for me if I can put the money into a high yield savings account so it can grow money, like it'll just grow just by sitting there. Um, and I'm not gonna have it just laying around where something could happen potentially. So I have this little tracker. Um, once I get to 52 envelopes filled, so that's gonna be about um, every three months. So it's gonna be quarterly since this week, I, since this um, challenge, I'm allowing myself to have 50 weeks which is four envelopes here per week and two envelopes from here per week. Um, so once I get 52 envelopes filled, so I'm just scratching off the numbers once I fill them, then I will um, unstuff them and put them into a high yield savings account. So I'm not gonna do all 300 envelopes in one unstuffing. So that might be disappointing for some people. I know people like watching huge amounts, but it should still be a pretty decent amount. And it'll be a complete surprise because I'm just pulling um, whatever I can. That's another thing I'm not doing. Um, I'm not doing like random envelopes. I'm like picking them strategically for the money that I have available so that I can make sure I fill up all six envelopes every single week. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and get into the stuffing portion. So here are my other little trackers. Since I made this challenge myself, um, I just made the little trackers myself. I didn't like make, I mean, I guess I did kind of make up this challenge. I took up, I took the idea and just kind of modified it to be pretty extreme because mm, that's just the kind of person I am. I'm an extreme person. So I scratched off all of the ones that I did. Um, I tried to do some of these bigger numbers when I had the good week and then when I had the bad week, I did all of these really small numbers. So my 50 week challenge, I'm doing two envelopes and my 200 week challenge or my 200 envelope challenge, I'm doing four envelopes. So I have $271, so let's see. I still have a lot of big numbers left. So if I do 271, let's see. 270, oh, 271, I could do, I have a lot of big numbers. Mm, if I do 200, if I do a 200 envelope, that leaves me with $71. So how would I split that up? five more ways. Um, I don't think I'm going to do 200. That's just too much right now. Um, I think I'm going to do, do I have 100? Yeah, I have 100 still that I need to do. Maybe I'll do 100 and then how much is that left? 171. Let's do, what if I do 49? 40, oh my gosh. Okay, we'll start with the 100 envelope challenge. We'll do 49, I'll do both of the next biggest numbers. So that leaves me with 173. So then let's think, I could do 
100. And then I could do 40. I need two more envelopes and I have $33 left. That actually, no, that's not gonna work because these are all even numbers. So I'm gonna have to do, I'll do 149, 149 envelope, not two. And then I'll do like a 28, we'll think, oh, just super random. Um, and then I, I do want to fill up a $100 envelope. That leaves me with $94. Okay, so that's an even number I can distribute. Um, we'll do like $60. Then I still need two more envelopes. I have $34. Um, I have, I'll do like a $10 one and then a 24. Okay, so that's how I'm gonna distribute this. I'm just literally just picking random numbers. Okay, so let's go ahead and cross these out really quick. So I have um, 149 envelope on this one and then I'm also doing, I think it was 28. Yeah, $28 on this one. So let's do that 49 and then 28. So that's gonna be on here. So let's see, I need $49. It's gonna be like the very last one. So I have 49, then I'm just going to do 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. Let's make sure. 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. Okay, so I will stuff that. Okay, also I'm it has a little, um, oops, fold it up. So I even, why is this not going in smoothly? Okay, there we go. Um, it has a little peel where I can seal it. I'm not going to because I think that is going to make my life very difficult when it comes to unstuffing them. And I want to reuse these. So once I'm done with this challenge, I plan on doing it again. So yeah, I'm not sealing them up. Okay, so then I will, next one is 28. So that's going to be somewhere here in the middle. 23, 25, 28. Perfect. Okay, so we'll do 20... Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Okay, so 28 is stuffed. And then I'm going to move this out of the way now, as well as this one. Now we just have the 200 envelope and this. So, I was going to do $100, so let's find the 100, it's going to be somewhere here in the middle, $100, perfect, so I have 100, so 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, right, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, okay. Okay, so that is stuff. And I'm going to put this here, cross out 100. Okay. And next up I have $60. So let's find 60. Okay. I have 60. I'll do 20, 40, 60. 20, 40, 60 dollars in here. Okay. So there's two envelopes stuffed. We'll cross out 60. And then I have $10 next. So let's find a $10 envelope. It's going to be close to the front. 8 and 10. Perfect. $10 and I'll just grab a 10. Okay, so $10 is stuffed, and I'll go ahead and cross out $10. Okay, and then lastly, I have $24. So I don't really want to stuff all these ones, so I'm going to consolidate them. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then 10. So I'm going to take from my um, change that I'm going to be bringing to work with me. So I have 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 dollars. 
for my last envelope. Let's go, it's gonna be up in the front. 24, perfect. So my $24 envelope. Okay. And now that one is stuffed. We'll put this in the back. And then, oh, before I forget, let's do 24. That one is filled. And then I filled up four envelopes. One, two, three, four. And then once I cross all the way down to 52, then we will unstuff. Okay, so my envelopes are stuffed for the week. And $271, not bad for putting away in just one week. I'm actually pretty excited about that. Hopefully next week I will be able to stuff an even bigger amount because it's I'm in part two of my budget actually right now. And if you don't watch my budgeting videos, then you won't know what I'm talking about. But you can watch my budget, my budgeting videos. I do bi-weekly budgeting. And um, part two, I only really have like one main bill. And so I don't have to put as much money away towards my actual budget so I can save a lot more. So I'm actually really excited for next week. I should have a lot more to save. Super excited. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to subscribe. And let me, know down, let me know down in the comments what you guys think, if I should do these with my server videos, if you like them better separate, if you like them at all. I think these kind of videos are really interesting to watch. I enjoy watching them. Um, I'm super excited about saving, and so these are fun for me. So just let me know what you guys think. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.